going on mortals? Mortal T here! And welcome back to How To Tame. Oh yes! Today we are going to be covering our first underwater dino, which is the angler fish. So this is how we are going to tame it. There is one here. I did spawn one in just make this easy. There it is. Right there. So 150 obviously. Hello. Oh, I haven't got my sword with me, so it's going to have to be this. Boo boo. Sorry. Anyway, yeah. There's another one. There's another one. Ink these. Go away, man. Please. I'm going to do something. So, yeah. It is a knockout tame. You will have to knock it out. The best thing. Did I just hear another Ixie? Are you. No? Oh, I heard no Ixie. Oh, oh my god, two of them. Go away, Ixies, please. Go away. Go away. So, yeah, it is a knockout tame, and the best thing at the moment is this the harpoon gun with the trank darts in it. You can also use a crossbow with some trank arrows, um, but you cannot use a long neck underwater. As you can see here, I'm actually clicking to shoot. You cannot use it underwater, but these harpoon guns, you can. So let's try, is this going to aggro? Should do now. Let's knock it out. Don't know how long it's going to take, because it is a 150. But make sure you get a, like a decent one of these, or you just get loads of tranks. Come on. And it's down. There we go, and it's down, it's down, it's down. So, the preferred food of this is uh, Karuku Kibble. So that is what you're going to need to get a perfect tame, which I have got some. We're just going to let its food drain a bit and watch out for any other underwater monsters that might come. So yeah, its favourite uh, kibble is the Karuku kibble. And to make that, you will need a Karuku egg, one cooked meat, one silver root, two medra berries, and three fibre. And obviously, you cook it in either a cooking pot or the industrial cooker. But that is not the only food you can tame it with. You can tame it with a variety of meats. So you can tame it with obviously the kibble. Raw mutton is the best uh, other, other than kibble. Oh, shark. And you're dead. <laughs> Let's get back to the meat, shall we? So raw mutton is the best. Then you've got cooked lamb chops getting attacked by everything god look at all these sharky walkies my english fish should kill them off pretty easy so yeah cooked uh, lamb chops raw meat uh, raw prime meat raw cooked raw cooked meat no <laughs> raw prime meat cooked prime meat raw prime fish meat then raw meat cooked prime fish meat cooked meat raw fish and cooked fish meat they're the they're all the foods you can tame them with and i was going down in order of how effective they are so mutton is at the top and the cooked fish meat is at the bottom but you do not need a saddle to ride the angalore fish you can ride it without one which is really really cool just get some food for it and these are supposed to have a few um like abilities kind of now it's little lantern at the on as you can see the little light there is meant to be like kind of a flashlight underwater so you can see a bit better in the deep dark depths of the ocean and I don't know if that's true or not Alpha Moser right there <laughs> uh, let's go, please. Oh, it's Jimmy. Go up, 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 up. <laughs> Wasn't expecting an Alpha Moser there. I could probably kill it, 
I really wanted to. Uh, but this guy's got no levels. It's got no health, so one bite would probably be a big dump on it. So put some movement speed in. So quickly pump some health, whatever. More movement speed. Right. So yeah, its lantern is supposed to act like a light source in all the underwaters. Where's that other monster? So I want to go somewhere away from there. Let's go this way, I think. So hopefully we don't come across anything else really bad. So let's see, is there any way of actually testing its light source abilities? So if we get off, does it, can, is there any difference in its light? I don't know. It may, oh please you saw. <laughs> God there's loads of stuff down here. Die. Thank you. There's usually two pleases. Not too sure, but it has got another ability that they did add, and I don't know if it works. It's supposed to be able to harvest silica pills, and it does. Whoa, 800 nod. So yeah, this is a good silica pill gatherer if you ever need uh, massive amounts of silica pills. Uh, this is a dino for you, which is a really cool feature that they added to the anglerfish which is actually really cool because it didn't really do much and no one ever really tamed them they just used to be to get on your nerves really that's what they used to do but now they have the ability to collect silica pills which is really really nice and also if you kill the anglerfish whoa okay if you kill the anglerfish it does it, it does drop angler gel now there isn't a lot of uses for angler gel, as far as I know there's only like one use that I know of and that is you can put it in standing torches and wall brackets and stuff and it will give you a different type of light. Instead of yellow it, the light will turn a bluish colour which is actually really cool. Uh, oh, there's a Utah Rance. Where did I park my Tyranodon? I don't know. I parked it on top of a rock somewhere. I'll have to find it somewhere, somehow. I don't know where I was. <laughs> I don't even know where I was. Oh, there it is on top. You can see it. it's floating in. But yeah, so that is the anglerfish covered. Let's jump off and it's loading. Let's stop it from following us. So yeah, really, really cool. Really nice creature, underwater creature to start off with. They do look kind of ugly but I don't know I think they're really cool I really like how you don't have to have a saddle to ride them it's really nice but anyway that is the anglerfish covered we have gone through it's oh my god here we go baryonyx are you kidding me can you just die just die 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 thank you Oh, I ate one of my flowers by mistake and now I'm freaking attacking me. What else is going to attack me? No one? No, here we go. Are you literally running towards me? Because of the rare flower? It, it, it was. <laughs> but yeah, that is the anglerfish. Oh my god, there's so much bad stuff around here. The anglerfish is covered. We've gone through uh, uh, how to tame it, what to tame it with, the best ways to tame it, uh, and its abilities and stuff. So I hope you enjoyed! And I'm in the water again. <laughs> Can we get out without it loading and messing up? So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you found it very informative. I hope it gave you some information. If you did, don't forget to share the like button. Who's boss? By punching it in the face. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And as always, mortals, don't forget to share it with your family and your friends. And around the world. That is it. I am Mortal T and I. I'm out.